Hey everyone, this is Sean from Montreal, Quebec, Canada, and you're watching Trucker Josh on TJV. Good morning everybody. Today is the day after Boxing Day, so it's no longer a holiday, so we're running into Winnipeg to do a few errands. You'll also notice that over there my pickup is still not back home in its rightful spot. It's getting a service in Steinbach, so a service, and also my washer fluid pump went on me, so I had to get that replaced as well. Apparently it's a pretty cheap part, but it's just Christmas and I haven't had, I don't have any time to do it myself, and I was getting, bringing it in for a service anyway, so that needs to get fixed, because up here the roads get really messy in the wintertime, and you need to be able to see where you're going. So if it's not spraying washer fluid, that's a problem. But look who's looking real good today. It's not me, it's her. Oh, that's pointing at you. Uh, going I guess this sort of be like a, a date day but it's without a date we're spending it together without a date Not well because we can go to McDonald's oh jeez typical Josh date <laughs> McDonald's and Walmart maybe we'll go for supper I don't know we, we don't know what we're doing we got to go and exchange one of the gifts she got me these these beautiful beautiful slippers that are have like this inch of memory foam on the bottom and it's so cushy and you just sit and sink into it but it's one size too small so we have to go and re replace those today or Exchange. exchange them today hopefully they have them yeah and then pick up the truck i'll drop off some stuff at my mom and dad's house some other gifts that need to be exchanged uh, diesel got himself a new harness a reflective vest harness and uh, i told my mom the size he needed turns out she got the size i asked for but he's a lot bigger than we anticipated a lot bigger than i thought or the <laughs> thing was smaller so we had to exchange it for a bigger one so we got to bring that there i left my keys for my semi at their house we got a whole bunch of things to do so Good thing you guys are here. It's gonna be a little bit busy. Off we go. So we're here in Winnipeg. Funny story. We opened this vlog yesterday. We came in to exchange the slippers. I tried on the slippers. I okayed the slippers. We got home, the slippers were too small. They Again, shrunk. they shrunk or my feet grew. I don't know what happened, but we're back. The next day. The story isn't that funny. For the exact same thing. So we'll just continue this vlog today because we actually didn't film anything yesterday. But we did get a lot of errands and stuff done, so it's not like we came to the city for nothing yesterday. We but... didn't get a lot of errands done, we just bought some stuff. Yeah, we bought some stuff. We ran some errands, we bought some things. We didn't run any, any errands. I spent a gift card at Bath & Body Works, got some candles and hand soaps, and we went to Chapters and got some books. Indeed. So uh, we're in the pickup today because we might need to pick up some supplies for our room that we're renovating but uh yeah let's go inside try this again i'm not leaving until we're satisfied 110 110 110 and a half percent took us forever to find a parking spot too because this mall is crazy for boxing week sales right now the whole lot around the entire mall packed it's crazy <laughs> Are we going in through the Hudson's Bay there? Or, yeah, sure. Or actually, there's an entrance right there, right? Eh? Yeah, we could go through there too. St. Vitale Center. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Had to walk back to the truck because I forgot the slippers in the truck. When we, go, when, when we come to the city, my brain shuts off. I think every country person's brain shuts off. Like, I was born and raised in the city, and even I go into panic mode when I enter the city. I just go into autopilot mode. Like, I can drive. My, my brain doesn't shut off, so I can't drive. I focus on driving, but I'm... Just, there's too many people. Too many people. Look at all these people. Crowded. All in one place. Yeah, and Winnipeg's a little dirty. But it's also winter and we got all the salt and everything everywhere. And, yeah, it's just I think dirty. most cities are dirty though. We can't just pick on Winnipeg. It's just a city thing. This is one of the better areas of the city too. Looks like we're getting a new store. Something. In the fancy, fancy mall. Well, these doors don't open all the way. They only half want you in here. This is where I get my glasses. Hmm. Hakeem? I think Hakeem? it's just pronounced Hakeem. But... Hakeem. Then we got the jet skier store. This is where we were talking about this yesterday. Yeah. Everything jets.
Okay, one size bigger, size 13 men's. We got the goods. Started off with 11, came back for 12, now we have 13. And the 14 were a bit too big, so now we know we got the right ones. <laughs> so, now we're going to the food court for our date. Fancy. How is it? Did I catch you in the right moment? Mm -hmm. Oh, good. This is what's for lunch today. From Kung Pao Wok. You pronounced it right, too. Thank you. I've been practicing my Chinese. It's Chinese, right? It's not Japanese? Yes, yeah, that's no definitely idea. Chinese writing there. Kung Pao Wok. I have no idea. I wonder what it means. I don't know. You want to go ask the employees? They might know. And what this whole day was about, let's go try them on. All right. How about those, eh, Diesel? Oh. Oh, yeah. Whoop. Ho. New slippers. Three trips. Oh, those are nice. Oh, oh, they just suck your feet in and give them a big memory foam hug. Oh, good. Don't show them our messy bathroom. <laughs> I'll show them our messy room back here. Oh, boy. Messy master bedroom. Gonna work on this a little bit today. Get another wall or two down. Maybe that outside one. Gotta get those lights off of there. And Yep, continue working on it. It's a work in progress. There's no real deadline that we have set for it yet. Just as soon as we can get it done, whenever we have time. I'm also cutting a piece of plywood for that door on the other side, just to keep everything in there. All right, boys and mom. Why is the Christmas tree not lit up? Chevy, that was your job. That was your job, man. And the little wiener dog needs to be lit up too. There we go. See? Get these lights on as well. Get this little guy on. Christmas is over already, but we still have all our lights set up, so it'd be a waste to have them all set up and not turn them on. All right, oh, why is this one? Oh, there we go. Whoa, easy there, Merry Christmas. All right. Got some lights over here yet. Plug these in here. All the way out over there. We got these over here. And plug in here. That's for all that. Alright. Doesn't feel like there we go. Brit's new mixer. I shouldn't touch it. Don't tell her. You didn't see me touch that. Chevy, look, it's Christmas again. Well, I guess Christmas is over. It's New Year's. With a tree. This is the ornament that we got from our nephews on Brit's side. They made this for us. Really nice and fits in with the theme and style of the house very well. Yes, we know there's uh, these lights are all burnt out there. We're gonna fix it after Christmas. I don't dare go in there and fix it now with all of these ornaments hanging off of it. So we're just running with it. It's a unique tree. Well, thanks for hanging out with us this holiday season uh, through Christmas and New Year's. And I hope you guys had a very Merry Christmas and that you're having a very happy New Year. So uh, I wasn't filming every day but uh, we took, took it sort of easy with the vlogs and stuff. Uh, as you can tell, we had this multiple trip, what do you call it, a circumstance, a situation with the slippers. Oh, Britt bought me these, like I was telling you, these amazing slippers from Softmock. The most comfortable things I have ever, ever put on my feet. They're amazing. But she got it uh, two sizes too small. Uh, but we thought it was just one size too small. So the first time we went into the city, got one size up. Went home. I tried them on there. It felt like they fit. But I went home. I don't know if it was if they shrunk or if my feet grew 
or if maybe just my socks were different, I don't know, but it, they were still too small. So we had to go back again the next day and I sort of combined those two days into this one vlog. And uh, so we made three trips, but man, was it worth it. Those slippers, I tell you, if you guys want the absolute most heavenly experience on your feet, in your house, go to Softmock and get some slippers from there. Wow, memory foam, you just seriously, there's like that much memory foam in there. And with each step you just sink in. Oh, it's so good. But anyways, enough about my slippers. I'll see you guys in tomorrow's vlog. Tomorrow, we're back on the road. We gotta head out towards BC. Got some freight to deliver. Good things must come to an end. Gotta get back to work.